Hey, everybody. Denzel, you've made two big plays in these first two preseason games. Uh, when you're healthy, you're capable of making those big plays every game. But how frustrating was it that weren't a, you weren't able to capitalize and there's no you to watch, watch an end zone man in that run? Did that set the tone? Uh, well, the interception, you know, it was a momentum change at the beginning of the game. Um, I mean, we got three points out of that. I mean, obviously, you know, we want to score. But uh, to drive after that, yeah, that wasn't, you know, the most appealing. Um, There's just a lot of things that, you know, we need to get back to the drawing board, go back and watch the film, and, I mean, just come down to fundamentals, not taking anything away from the Dolphins. You know, they, you know, make plays. That's what we're here for. But just come down to fundamentals and execute Uh, just play action, just going through like my keys, uh, just read play action, kind of froze for a second, to be honest with you. And uh, I was just reading quarterback, kind of just got in the window, just had a feel for it. And, and how's, how's you guys play stars for the first time in the preseason and the quarterback and all of that, working with uh, you know, the coaching staff? What was that like on the sideline and functioning through what will likely be a dangerous situation later on? Uh, you know, just get to the sideline, make those adjustments. Uh, like I said, man, just come down to execution fundamentals at the end of the day. Hey, man, you know, it's, it's a Florida thing, man. You know, Florida thing. Came to work today. Came to work today. <laughs> um, I, as one of the leaders on the defense, it started out well, but did you like the intensity level of your guys the whole way through that first unit that was out there? I mean, not just the first unit. Uh, you know, we will talk about the whole unit as the defense and as you know, one of the leaders there. Uh, I felt like, you know, like I said, after that, you know, the turnover and whatnot, you know, just, they drove down the field that second drive and I felt like, you know, even coming into halftime, you know, like you said, that intensity, that energy, it wasn't the same that, you know, we carried all week. And like I said, I, I know myself, I gave up, you know, some things that drive. Um, so it's just, like I said, just getting back down to the fundamentals and just execute. Hey, Denzel, um, what did you see from the team's run defense today? Because it seemed like ever since you started turning from the running things that Coach DeLuca has been talking about, they stopped that run. Yeah, uh, I mean, we did get to the ball. Uh, we just got to, like, wrap up. We got to set the edge, and uh, block protection was another thing. Like I said, just back down the fundamentals. Uh, again, not taking away nothing from the, the Dolphins' offense. Uh, they capitalized from, you know, how mistakes today. What do you think about Will's strip sack? Is he capable of doing that on a consistent basis? Uh, I've said this before. Will comes to uh, the work every day angry. So, yeah, I can see him doing that every play, every day. And uh, I thought it was an amazing play, to be honest with you. I'm surprised he didn't get it. You got to teach him. You got to tackle the ball carrier, whoever's trying to go get the ball, and just let everybody else rally to it. Does, uh, just still kind of learning a little bit, but it's interesting to see Henry go from playing the middle linebacker to the outside. Did you notice any areas where he looked very comfortable? Uh, he just looked comfortable out there, period. I mean, uh, Henry, he's just learning, it, it, like, itself and whatever, you know, the coaches have for him to do, whatever challenge it is, like, he's accepted, just put his head down and just get to work. And then I asked you uh, earlier about training camp, what do you like about his sacks and interceptions? You seem like he's been modeling interceptions. Did you think it's still my favorite touching cutter? I mean, honestly, when I catch interceptions, man, I be laughing in my helmet, like, a lot of people don't know that. Like, I be laughing because, number one, it's like I caught the ball. Like, I'm bound to drop the ball, to be honest with you. So, when I catch an interception, I just start laughing. And at that point, like, I'm literally just playing like a game like a little kid. Like, everybody was telling me I should have heard with two. And I'm like, honestly, I just seen him fall, and I seen my cleats the next two seconds. So, yeah. yeah thinking about moving forward, right? You've got two recent games in the books, obviously two joint practices. you got to go down to New Orleans and help your bills. But you're a vet now. You've been through this. Yeah. You asked Nico about your leadership and. They target you. You were the guy that they needed in the middle of that different season. Smile, you understand? <laughs> so it's on you. This is my question thinking yeah. about moving forward to get this defense where it needs to get to. What keeps you up at night? What aspects of two games in now do you think about with the personnel you practice with every day? What are those pinpoint elements you like? We got to elevate here or it's going to get ugly. Uh, well, I can say just making the team one dimensional. Uh, you know, we want to go back and, you know, really look at stats. They were, what, 400, almost 200 on both sides, you know, rushing and passing. So uh, unless you, you know, playing a, a real good Madden game, like, you know, ain't no way, you know, the, both teams going to, like, some, somebody's got to win. But the team that, you know, is not executing, and I, we just happen to be on that end of the day, 
And uh, moving forward, like like I said, it really just comes down to fundamentals and technique. So I'm pretty sure this week we just, just going to be uh, like it might just be day one, you know, training camp, to be honest with you. I mean, I know we're going to go have a joint practice and, you know, it's the time, you know, to get better and grow. And you know, like I said, just learn from this film and really bring our toolbox next week because I'm pretty sure the Saints ain't letting off on us at all. So. Appreciate that, though. No problem. Thank you.